everyone this is abdul wasi and you are watching say that solution welcome back to another c sharp tutorial in this tutorial we are going to see how to uh, how to check the combo box in a c sharp that is when uh, that one is uh, selected or not so here we are going to create a new project as you see here and i am not going to uh, name it then i okay here we are and I just increase the size okay here I'm going to uh, drop combo box and here we will need the button for the save an example here is a combo box here is a button and this we need to label for the error for the error i use here static and four color will be red will be red it's a maroon sorry red this one i will increase the font size here 10 or 15 that's one good so here is a uh, combo box here is the button and here is the error label that will show the user uh, you will have to uh, select this combo box or and I will going to name it like save and i will going to use label for the name it for the name combo box i will name it the status just imagine uh, this is the form you are getting uh, you are getting the employee uh, details and there is a combo box uh, like the status so user will have to and you want to uh, user will have to uh, select the status combo box so how will you check uh, how will you will check that user user is selected or not so here we are going uh, on the save button uh, double click and generate the uh, click event and here we write if first we have to uh, name the combo box here sorry and status box save in the if if bracket we have to write a condition for the check uh, the status combo box so status box dot selected index equals to equals to minus one why i write here minus one because combo box in dash index starts with zero if i write here minus one that means there is selected nothing there is selected false so if there is selected false it will give you error so how you uh, show the user show the user error it depends on you i am going to show the user here uh, f uh, using this one using this label and i am going to by default the visible false and after if it will uh, the blank it will select it false i will visible it so how will visible it label one dot visible equals to true and if user selected so do not show the error so here we are going to do false this and then start first i do not uh, select and save so see there there is an error you can also show the message box uh, uh, message box then I, uh, you will have to uh, message box you can uh, you can you can just like that i am going to do on this message box not show 
and here is a message required required field check required field then edit active inactive okay save here is the message required field and if i will select this error will go on so that's all for today if you have any query you can ask the question in the comments box thank you for watching